hey guys it's michael welcome back to my youtube channel in this video i want to show you my full body push day i am currently training the workout started with four sets of advanced tuck planche holds um, going back to advanced tuck planche holds to create some volume to really work on the technique and since i got a little heavier it's also mandatory for me to step back to keep the quality of the movement high The workout continued with 8 sets of deep hands and push up doubles, um, using doubles and a lot of sets here to create volume since balance is my limiting factor and doubles I can control pretty good already but as you can see doubles still provides some struggles so yeah hopefully uh, I can soon switch to triples to have a little less sets and get that workout done faster but at the moment I work with doubles and eight sets to get the volume done. The next exercise is bench press. I did 4 sets, 8 reps with 95kg, so pretty light to just ease into the block and not to overload too fast. And I switched um, dips with bench press lately to work a bit more chest dominant to work on this weak spot, but maybe I will switch to back to dips again in the future.
Since it's a full body push day, we obviously also need to include our legs. I start the warm up with spanner squats. This helps me to pre-activate my quads and to also warm up my quad tendon, which um, provides me some problems. And yeah, to really warm that up and to not stress it too much with the warm up static warm ups like the spanner squat is a good choice for me here and afterwards i continue with limited rom squats to again not overload the tendon because if i go below 90 degrees um, it starts to hurt again so i just limit the range of motion i work with pretty high reps in reserve like three to five reps in reserve to not overload it and once that topic hopefully is done in the future with the quad tendon i can finally go back to wheel squats real range of motion and real weights to also compete again As a finisher for this workout, I included some isolation exercises for lateral delts and triceps. I supersetted them both, so I did three sets of this superset. So 15 to 20 reps of the lateral raises followed by 8 to 12 reps of the triceps pushdowns. 